It's the most wonderful time of the year With the kids jingle belling and everyone Good morning, Indian Run. Welcome to a holiday edition of The Wire. I hope you had a cozy weekend. This is Lauren. Let's get started with the birthdays for the week. Here's Renee with the birthdays. Hi, everyone. This is Renee. I'm here to share the birthdays with you. Our birthdays this week are Yusei, Kaito, Evie, Owen, Emika, Louie, and Elise. I'm sorry if I said any of your names wrong. Happy birthday, everyone. Have a great one. Thanks, Renee. Next, Callan has the first part to the riddle of the week. So the first part of the riddle is, if otters keep their money in riverbanks, where does Frosty the Snowman keep his money? Now while you think about the answer, here's Kenley to share some kindness shoutouts. Hello, Indian Run. It's Kenley, and I'm here to share the kindness shoutouts for the week. The first one comes from Miss Riley for Jaden in Mrs. McGrath's class. He helped Moa get up when they fell and asked if they were okay. Awesome job, Jaden. The next one's from Addison to Quinn and Grayson. When Addison was having trouble getting a book bin down from the shelf and all the books fell out, Quinn and Grayson rushed to, rushed to help her pick it up. Nice one, Quinn and Grayson. The last one's from Miss Sutherland to Smith in Mrs. McGrath's class. Smith helped clean up the jump ropes and hang them up at recess so Miss Renee wouldn't have to clean up after everyone. Great job, Smith. Well done, in everyone, and keep spreading kindness. Thanks. It's always amazing to hear about kindness. And now it's time for our holiday message from the principals. Good morning, Indian Run, and happy Monday. Welcome to your last week before winter break. We told you last week that we were going to be looking around the building for kindness, and we saw it, did yes. we not? So we're going to go through and just share some of those because we have one week left. We would love to see even more kindness, and we wish you a great week as you wrap up uh, this this first half of the school year. So our first shout-out goes in kindergarten. I have seen Jack Myers. Every time I see him, he says hello. Mm -hmm. He has a smile on his face, just as nice as can be. That's a great way to sh uh, share some kindness. Have you seen some? I have. In first grade, last week, Mr. Osman and I had to help Miss Buzzard's classroom because there wasn't a substitute. And Leo in Mrs. Buzzard's class was so helpful as we were her, the guest teachers in the classroom. Yeah, and very similar to just sharing kindness, Rima in second grade, every time I see her, big smile on her face, always saying hello. I love it. In third grade, we have Gabe and Jaden. Awesome energy they bring to the building every day with asking questions and just sharing their joy uh, for school and for life. So that's awesome to see. In fourth grade, I was on the playground and a group of fourth graders asked me to play a game called Grounders. Oh. It made me feel included and I had so much fun. Make sure you always ask others to play a game because it could make their day just like it made mine. And do you have a fifth grade shout out? Yeah, and this week in fifth grade, I had to borrow Mrs. Kinder's room for um, something to do with some teachers and I couldn't remember how I had the classroom set up so I borrowed Silas and he helped me reset up the classroom so it was ready for Mrs. Kinder. Thank you so much, Silas, for using your kindness. Well, we hope you all have a great week. Like we said, five days until winter break. Make it solid. Have a great day. And remember, what begins here will change the world. Have a good week. Thank you, Mr. Osmond and Mrs. Brown. Every week, there's a holiday celebrated somewhere in the world. Tatum is here to share the holiday of the week. Hello, Indian Run. I'm Tatum, and I'm here to share the holiday of the week. This holiday is Christmas. Christmas is celebrated by a lot of people. Here's a fact about Christmas. There are about 630 types of Christmas trees to choose from. That's a lot of trees. Do you know what type of tree you have? Merry Christmas, everyone, and happy holidays. And now here's Kyle with the answer to the riddle. Here's the riddle again. If otters keep their money in riverbanks, where does Frosty the Snowman keep his money? A snowbank. Now for a special ending, please welcome Ananya and Lauren for Who's Behind the Curtain. Check it out. Thanks, Lauren. Now it's time for Who's Behind the Curtain. So I'm here with Ananya, and she has three um, guesses to guess who is behind the curtain. Okay, um, is it a third grade teacher? No. Is it a boy? Yes. Okay, uh, is it a fifth grade teacher? No. Okay. You have to guess who it is. Um, I have no idea. Okay. It is Mr. Mr. Phillips! Woo! Thanks everyone for watching. Please get ready to say the pledge with your class. For The Wire, this is Lauren signing off. Don't forget to be kind, be respectful, and be amazing. Make it a great break, Indian Run, and happy holidays. Goodbye. Be of good cheer. 
It's the most wonderful time of the year. It's the happiest season of all. 